DJI Mavic Pro unfolded. To make it this small, we had to rip out a ton of cool stuff, right? No, it's got 24 high performance computing cores, dual satellite. So after almost a month of waiting, then uh, this package arrived here today. And uh, we're going to be doing an unboxing of this uh, DJI Mavic Pro. And we'll do an unboxing and take a close-up look at the drone, the controller and everything else that's inside the box. So this is the box that it came in. Um, you can see it's uh, shipped by DHL Express Worldwide. Shows the weight over here at 2.2 kg. On the other side then you see this sign about the packaging of the lithium-ion batteries. So there's a picking list over here. Just pull it out. So this is the Mavic Pro box itself. Um, you can see an image of the drone over here at the front. At the back then uh, you see some details, some instructions about reading the safety manual before using the drone. Um, how it's made for the iPhone. Um, you can get apps on Google Play and uh, App Store and, and the Apple App Store and then also manufactured by DJI in Shenzhen and on the other side then there's nothing else over here it's just a regular box so here we go wow it's really really nice you can see the drone over here and the controller over here and at the top over here then you see these cutouts and then they are to protect uh, the drone as well as the remote so you see these cutouts over here so this is the drone itself as you can see it's nicely packed in the box and the props aren't on yet and over here then you see the charging cable as well as the remote so first and foremost then the drone let's take it out here so there's some packaging here, just put it up there, this looks like the props and this is the remote as I mentioned earlier, some cushioning and these are some manuals, um, a quick start guide what comes in the box guidelines on the battery there's also a DJI Care Refresh card here um, what does it do? basically it's like an insurance for your drone gives you accelerated service, uh, support service, free shipping and so on and so forth and at the bottom over here then you see the charger so this is the charger uh, I'm not sure if it's a charger for the remote or the drone yet for the battery yet so let's see and over here let's see what do we have here this is for the charger there's a USB cable and these are cables for the remote to connect to your phone or your tablet just to recap again this is pretty much everything that comes in the box um, you have the drone over here the remote Charging cable so over here, USB cable over here, RC cables so over here, your documents, manuals, and your props. So now we're going to take a closer look, a super close up look at each of the components in the box. We start first with the drone. Let's take a look at the body of the drone. These are the legs. You can unfold the rear arms downwards um, and over here unfold the front arms forwards. These are where you would then um, put in the propellers, both sides of it. Look at it from the rear. The DJI logo in the middle and you have your lights over here and the legs are over here and there's another light LED over here. There's some vents over here, um, probably for the for the motor to prevent some overheating. You can also see the finishing of the DJI. It's kind of rough, not really a smooth kind of finishing. 
but it's quite nice. Let's look at the other side. Over here you see the Mavic Pro logo. The words. Both legs. Take a look at the front. Um, so you can see the gimbal covers over here. It's not taken it out yet. And we're back to the side. At the top of the drone itself, uh, there's a label here telling you how to turn it on and off the power. Um, you can also see the lights over here, LED lights here, probably to indicate the battery life. Let's take a closer look at the gimbal cover here. Can take it out. There's some light here. So this is the gimbal cover itself. Plastic cover here. It's very very nice. And let me take a closer look at the bottom. You can see the propellers are already fixed at the bottom. Let's move it to the side so you guys can take a look. It's really really sleek. Let's take a look at the rear. You can see the sensors at the bottom here. Some sort of metal. And you can see the DJI Mavic logo embossed into the metal here. This is a view of the gimbal and the lens. Let's take this out. So here it is, the lens and the gimbal. Take a look at that. Let's take a look from this side as well. And let me remove this clamp. So with the clamp removed, then you can see that it's kind of wobbling. I'm gonna unfold the legs here. Fold the front ones forward like this. Then you can also fold the other ones like this. at the drone in more detail then over here you have the battery and you can depress the button here at both sides to take out the battery and the bottom is a catch here where you have your USB slot and on the other side of the drone then there's another catch here you can take it out and over here you have your switch for Wi-Fi RC as well as your SD card slot so it comes with a 16 gigabyte micro SDHC card from Panasonic. And at each arm then you also see some cables here. And just to give you a size comparison then that's my Samsung S6 Edge right beside the Mavic Pro. So now we're gonna look at the remote itself. So this is the remote control. It's really nice. It feels quite ergonomic, it's not large and the controls feel good as well. So you can see from the front, there's a power button over here, um, a return to home button over here, pause, as well as a joystick over here, and at the top, um, a record button over here, photo button over here, and two wheels over here. The antenna folds out like this. And there's a DJI logo at the top as well. And there's like a aluminium or metal mesh over here. At the bottom then, these can be folded out 
for you to fit your smartphone. So there's a slot here and you can place your smartphone over here with a jack. If you look at the side, there's an RC cable over here. So you can obviously take this out and fit it with the other RC cables provided. On the other side, this would be your sport mode button. So you can click it up to activate your sport mode. At the rear, you have two customizable buttons over here. And there's some details about the model and so on. It feels really ergonomic. It's very nicely built and has a quite a good weight as well. And the nice touch of this remote is that the antennas really fold in and there's a catch at the top here. We can see there's a catch right over here. So that it really stays tight. Looking at the propellers that we've been given then uh, here it is. There are actually four propellers that are given an extra. So I guess an extra pair of propellers here. So we have in total four. So let's take a look at the propeller. Here it is. It's pretty nice and light. And it's like a lock symbol here and if you turn it around this is what it looks like as well and this is the charger over here the DJI sign this is where you plug this in to the socket and if you look at the rear then you can see uh, more details about the power adapter, the model, the input, output, and so on and so forth. There are two slots here, one would be for the remote. And this slot here would be for the battery for the drone. Last but not least, then we look at the remaining RC cables. This cable is for phones or tablets with the micro USB and this one comes with a USB-C slot. So there you have it, that's everything that's inside the box. Um, hope you enjoyed this and uh, stay tuned for the first flight.